So, you guys may be hearing about YouTube's new COPA policy, the Child Online Privacy Protection Act. Well, we want to talk to you guys about how it works. Actually, scratch that. We want to talk to you about why it is awful. It's a terrible new policy, and here's why. Now... If you guys have seen videos on COPA, then this video has already been spoiled for you, but I don't care. I have more to say. So, the whole point of the child children's online pri privacy protection agency is to protect children from personalized ads on channels they see on YouTube. So, Just ads. Yep, personalized ads. Just ads. Yep, just ads. So here, so the whole point of this is that a lot of a lot of channels on YouTube they have to select if they're going to be for kids or not for kids. And, and so, that can really ruin their channel. Yep, yeah, if you tap for kids. Then here's the thing, the, the whole point of it is that comments will be disabled, your likes and dislikes will be disabled, you'll only receive 10% of the money you get from ads. Now, I don't get any money from making videos, but, but I don't really care, I'm, I'm, I just want to make this video defending those channels. Now, I watch a lot of channels on YouTube like Dude Perfect, Odd Ones Out, SBL, and and yeah. a lot of those great channels that other kids like to watch. And if what they- if you're like, what, what if you're like 13 and you, and you watch something that's not really targeted for kids? Well, here's the thing. If you set not for kids, your channel is a-okay. And so what happens is that if you set your channel for kids, there's no notifications, no likes, no dislikes, no comments, period. Now, that may sound harmless, but here's the thing. YouTubers need that money to continue making videos. And if they, and if a lot of videos that kids like to watch... If their creators don't get any money, they can't continue making videos, and they'll have to shut down production. So, like, um, let's say, like, if you make, um, Legos, uh -huh. like Lego videos, and they're not necessarily targeted for kids, if you still want to make Lego videos, they just say, Legos are for kids, so you have to make them for kids. Yes, that's true. And there's a really good video of that by Edbound. I'll leave a link in the description below for you to watch. Alright, so... And other channels, like S like Super Bowser Logan, he makes plush videos. And he's had a long history of swearing in his videos. And then he finally... Stop swearing in Super Bowser Logan. And he's also had a history of demonetization. Yep. So now everything's good. He got his ads back and he makes videos on SBL. But no, YouTube has to be like, hey, the hey, you said the word crap in that video. You your videos are getting demonetized. Oh, and here's the thing. If you set your Even video for smallest? kids what? Even the smallest? Yes, word? even the slightest even the slightest curse word can get your video demonetized. It's stupid. It's so dumb. Oh, and you better make... And here's the thing. Even the sl... If you set your videos for kids, and you say even the slightest cuss word like crap or pissed off, then here's the thing. You... They will fine you $42,000. What the heck? It can ruin channels that put so much passion and effort into their videos. And if you find them forty-two thousand dollars, they're gonna they may have to shut down production. That could also hurt their um 
or what you call it. That could really hurt their family. It can. Some of those videos, they don't really have much of a choice. They can't go out and get a job at, let's say, at a school or at a business. No. The YouTubers need that money to support them and their families. If you find them for $42,000, they may not make as much money as they used to. Alright, make sure you title this on video, YouTube. Please watch this. Yes, and if you watch this video, then please share it with a friend. Now, here's the thing, guys. This act is not coming out yet, so we have time. It's coming out on January 1st, 2020. Here's one thing, though. When I was about to post a video on YouTube, it said you have to comply with COPPA. Yes. Alright, now COPPA is bad, but here's the thing about it. You, the, the actual site for YouTube, it, according to... It's like 5% good and like 95% bad. Yeah, it is. And here's the thing, if you want to if you want to protect your kids from bad content on YouTube, then this put on put on restricted mode or get YouTube Kids. Exactly. And here's the thing, if you use Kappa, then all those good all those good family-friendly channels on YouTube, they're going to have to be taken down and more mature channels are going to take over. I know. It's a bad decision, YouTube. Don't do this. You're gonna, you're not only hurting the channels, you're hurting yourself too. Right, because you're making YouTube just like a completely horrible place if you do that. Yes, YouTube, you can't release COPPA. It's suicide. More like tubicide. <laughs> yeah. So here's the thing, parents. <laughs> If you support COPPA, don't, please. If you want to protect your kids from mature content on YouTube, put on restricted mode or get them YouTube kids. Right? Yes. Now, though all of this hasn't happened, there is hope. There's, there's a petition going on that you can sign for, to prevent COPPA from from releasing the new policy. And we're near a million. Yep. I'm gonna leave a link down in the description. So please, share this video with a friend and let them watch it and let them sign the petition. It's do- YouTube's new policy is doing way more harm than good. Harm to the majority of YouTube's channels. Yes, it's for the majority of you of the channels on YouTube. All the channels that put so much passion, love. Re I say like Dude Perfect is meant for all. Yeah. And like they get a lot of money off theirs. Yes, they, they do. do it for kids, and that would really hurt them. Yes, they do. When I first made Zoomates, I put a. The first video was just so random, and now I put a lot of effort into them, and I'm and I'm planning on putting more effort into my future videos so I so that I can make more money for my channel. And if YouTube releases this new policy, I might I may not make money on YouTube. Well, you know, I don't know what to say. Yeah. So please, everyone. Share this video with a friend. Save YouTube. Sign the petition down below. Alright, um... But please, do not let YouTube take over. This is corruption. This is pure corruption. YouTube's supposed to be a free site where you can, down where you can download anything you want. Yeah, this is called overprotection. Over times 99 protection. Yes. So please, like, YouTube. There's, there's a lot of overs. 99, like, like thousands of overs. Yes, so please, YouTube, don't release this.
we we need more kids channels on YouTube and if you and the way we can put more family friendly content on YouTube is if you get those family friendly channels ads that are personalized These are all types of ads Yes and So please, well, thanks for watching, everyone. God, God bless YouTube. Only time will tell how dangerous this is going to be for the website, for the people who are on here. Just update every single channel in YouTube. Sign this petition, please. I'm not advertising. I'm just asking. Yes, please. Thanks. What? Let's do the <sighs> So, yeah. Goodbye, everyone. Bye. Thanks for watching. Thanks for watching.